Greetings, Olof here. So a few of you have requested uh, interest in uh, trying out my mod collection and ask about uh, the configuration settings that I have done. So I'm going to help you out with that in, in this uh, little video. So the first thing you have to do is install the alternative mod launcher, the AML. Like, that is like a necessity. And then of course subscribe to to the mod collection and after that you need to download the zip file with all the INI stuff and um, let's see here yeah this is the AML and then you should make like categories for the 11 mods in, in question here like it, the way you do that is um, you right click on the mod and then move to category and new category and then you call it well, whatever you want in, in this case uh, ani mods so it, just so it will be easy for you to find them so let's, uh, let's pick one here for example uh, better advent uh, were the chosen so after you have put them in categories like this uh, you choose this you right click and show in explorer and then that will open up the uh, this stuff here and then you click on config and you will see this so you won't see it here because i have deleted these these folders but there's two folders called one called chrysalids and one called purifier and those are folders that you should delete, you just straight up delete them. And that is the only thing you're going to have to delete. You don't, you don't have to delete anything else in, in any other mode. The only other thing you have to do is uh, copy and paste the INI uh, files into the right folders for each of these 11 modes. So let me show you here an example. here so this is the stuff in the in the zip file so then you open for example the, a better advent for the chosen click on that and then on the config and then you have a file here called xcom ai so you just copy that and then you go back to to this Show an explorer again, config, and then you will see down here a file with the same name, and then you just copy it in here, or paste it in here, and replace it, and that is it. And then you do the same thing for all the other 10 mods. Oops, and, and then you're done. It's that easy. And um, you will find the links to the zip file in the description of this video that you can download and you will also find a link to uh, the master mod list of this entire collection that you can just subscribe to in in, in the steam workshop like uh, just with in, in one go because i previously published this in uh, like six parts but you can do it like in, in one collection if you want that instead and um, that is pretty much it, I think. And if you have any questions, just um, just ask in the, in the comment section, and I will try to help you out. And I'll also show you this again, that you can see. You can pause the video and read this if you if you want to. And maybe another thing I should mention is um, you, you better have a pretty powerful computer if you're gonna try out this this mod list. I'm, I'm just warning you because uh, I have a decent computer, not, not the best, but I have a decent one and with this many mods it takes me like 3 minutes to load load up the game <laughs> I'm serious, it takes like 3 minutes and I have uh, I had a game installed on an F2 or a Firecuda, what is it called? Firecuda M2, the super fast hard drives and even with that it takes like 3 minutes to load the game so that is going to take you some time. And 
But v- once it's loaded up and the game runs just fine, so that's not a, an issue. But uh, the loading time is pretty heavy, and of course, the better computer you have, the the, the less the, the loading time will be. But uh, so so don't worry about um, the game is not gonna crash just loading up. It just takes a real long time to to load up. So I just wanted to to warn about that. And um, yeah, I hope that will be of help. Bye bye for now.